today's story is Skip Finds the Treble Clef. Look what I found, a treasure map with clues. Letters scattered all around, what should we do? Do you see the treasure map? Look at the map with an X by the G. What could it mean? What could it be? Here comes music to help lead the way. Let's start with the B. We're doing okay. Here's music. There's the letter B. Here comes Skip. The letter B is pointing the way to the tree. What's in the trunk? The letters C and D. Do you see the C and the D on the tree trunk? The D leads us forward to a dish on the ground. Do you think there's a letter under there to be found? Here's the dish. Do you think there's a letter under there? Let's see. Here comes Melody to help us on our way. Look underneath the dish. Why, it's the letter A. A leads to the notes that sit on the staff. If we climb up every line, we'll reach the letter E and F. There's the E, there's the F. Look, here's the X and on it the G. It leads to the G clef. Now what can that be? There's the X and the G. And there's our G clef. Here it is curling from the bottom all around. This is a G clef for playing high sounds. It circles round the second line, the line we call G. The G clef, the G clef for you and for me. Do you know which hand plays this special clef? We will use our right hand instead of the left. We followed the map and the X marked the spot. Found the G and the G clef. You're sure learning a lot. Here it is. With all the line and space notes, there's your treble clef your G clef, and there's the G on that second line with our music alphabet letters, and there's Skip showing us the way. That's Skip finds the treble clef.